Hello and welcome to Excel-DashboardTemplates.com. This is Steve Equals True. Please visit my blog at Excel-DashboardTemplates.com where you're sure to learn the latest posts, tips, tricks, and techniques, and learn everything about Excel. All right, today I'm going to show you a really cool uh, labeling option for charts that is in Excel 2013. Uh, so check this out. We have uh, five different products. We've got their values represented in these columns. If you hover over them, you see that one's 1202, this one's 801, and this one is 1249. Uh, and then above them, I have these special labels uh, that are plus the number that they are from the previous period. So plus uh, 1913, uh, this one's down a thousand, this one's plus, plus. So um, let me show you a really cool option uh, that you now have in Excel 2013. In the show notes, I'll show you how you can do this in Excel 2007 and 2010. Uh, but this is a special um, edition for 2013. So, uh, so here we have our chart data. So we have sales, and then over here we have our previous period plus 1913 plus a thousand minus a thousand. Um, and so what you want to do is you want to have your data set up for the labels, and you want to have your data set up for the chart. Go ahead and create your chart by highlighting the data range. Go up to your insert ribbon then go over to any chart that you're looking for um, and uh, go ahead and we're just going to do a 2D clustered column chart. Uh, we'll move this up over here and then um, <clears throat> what we want to do is we want to uh, select our chart, go up to the design ribbon up here. Uh, there's going to be add a chart element button and we want to do data labels. Now we want to do this more data labels option because that's where we're going to see what we want to do. And you see here it says value. Well, let's uncheck value. And what we want to show is value from cells. When we check that, we get this dialog box here that says, what is your data label range? I'm so excited Excel put this in Excel 2013. You can highlight your label data range. Click on OK. And let's go ahead and close this down. Um, and you see now we have our data labels are not our normal chart data labels, but in fact a different series that we have in our spreadsheet. So uh, an awesome reason to uh, change and move up to Excel 2013. Once again, you can also do this in um, Excel uh, 2007 and 2010, and I'll put that uh, video link in the show notes. Thanks once again. Uh, please visit my Excel dashboard templates.com blog. Also, don't forget to sign up for my, my YouTube channel so that you're sure to get the latest posts delivered directly to your inbox. Thank you.